guys, look what I got. It's a magic genie speaker that plays music, talks, and no stuff, all without wires. A pair's a wire. No more from you, please. All right, let me squinch my face up and put on a pair of glasses I never wear to look at these directions. Boy, if they were giving out medals for tiny writing. <laughs> huh? Huh? Okay. Now, to activate the speaker, you say its name. Brandy. And now you just talk at it. Brandy, what's going on in the news? Breaking news from the Huffington Post. Prince bred purple dolphins. Wasn't there a senator shot this morning? You see, right there. This device is a perfect example of how we continue to become more inept due to our dependency upon machines. There was a time, not too long ago, when people would talk to each other. Yeah, the bad times. The sucky ages. Our society is doomed. People and technology are a bad match. Just like moms and Radiohead. Oh, no. No, no, this isn't music. No, I don't like this, David. No, that's enough. No, David, I don't like that. No. Sharon. Hey, it's Brian Griffin. Wondering if you were free for dinner on Saturday. You died? Oh, so you're dead right now? What's that like? God, why am I such a loser? Possible reasons for being a loser. Bad breath. Arrogance. Unemployment. Okay, okay, this is not helping my hangover. The Hangover Part 3. Available for instant download. I never saw it. Is it good? Searching reviews. Top critic on Rotten Tomatoes says, I walked out of the theater and I'm Ed Helms. Okay, no download, but thanks. Maybe you are useful. But I bet you can't answer this question. Brandy, what is love? John Lennon said, love is the answer. He also said, no thanks, every hot woman. I'll take this woman crawling out of the well from the ring who none of my friends like. Yeah, I bet they were all like, oh no. Downloading Yoko Ono. Oh no. Downloading more Yoko Ono. No, no, no Ono. Oh, Downloading all Yoko Ono. <laughs> oh no. I don't care for this music either, David. Boy, you know, I haven't stayed up all night talking like that in forever. And thanks for suggesting I buy that Fitbit. Customers who bought Fitbit also bought enormous exercise ball that's always in the way. Why not? Just put it on my card. Oh, good. There she is. Brandy, this is very important. What's the biggest poo anyone has ever pooed? Come on, Peter. History's largest bowel movement occurred in 1998 at a Hardee's in Memphis by Aretha Franklin. Damn, I owe Chris five bucks.